My name is John Resnikoff and my company is University Archives. People always ask me, what's the book fair? What's it all about? And I think people have this impression that it's a bunch of guys with bow ties that are very scholarly, that are looking at old books and not a lot of color. And to me, this place is just full of life and it's a lot more than books. It's books, relics, history, popular culture, you name it, it's here. And this is the absolute pinnacle of the trade. I love the historical part of the business. I love being able to hold in my hand something that Abraham Lincoln thought long and hard about. This is a, a general order signed by Robert E. Lee, and you can see his signature there. And what makes this particularly interesting is that it's right at the high watermark of the Confederacy. This is when it looked like the South was gonna win. And this is a treasure. You never see anything of this content. This is one of my favorite items. This is a letter from Alexander, or Alec as he signs here, Bell. And it's written to his parents, Ma and Pa Bell. It's written just shortly after he invented an interesting little device called the telephone. And I consider this to be probably one of the top 10 scientific letters in, in private hands. What I try to acquire are things that are cool, that people stop and they go, ooh, ah, and um, have a little pizzazz to them. Uh, these are a real treasure. Uh, these are Bruce Lee's training mitts. They're called focus pads, and he used them every day. And what's so great about these is the photos of him hitting these actual pads. This is a particularly exciting and interesting George Washington letter. And it's dated 1780, and it's a fantastic letter. My favorite part of the business is tomorrow, because there's always excitement around the corner.